Shalom and good day all. This is Tehillim29 back again for another comic and trade haul. And in this week's comic haul, uh, as you can see, I've got some stuff here from my LCS from the free comic book day. Um, just something that they sent through to me. So a big thank you and shout out to All Star Comics. Um, as you can see here, we've got some Sonic, which I probably won't read. The Valiant One with Ninjak, which I probably won't read. Judge Shred, which I probably won't read. So I'll probably give some of these away. Um, Into the House of Slaughter. Uh, that I'll definitely want to check out and read. Uh, Spider-Man Venom, probably won't read. Um, Beast Boy Raven, probably won't read. Legend of Korra, probably won't read. Uh, this one is one I might read, and that's the Zom 100. And last but not least, the special edition of uh, the Batman one. And if you happen to live in Australia, do check out their website. Do add this discount code and you'll get 10% off anything you buy in the store. Uh, moving into the trades that I ended up getting this week. Now, I'm surprised that this was actually hardcover. I thought it was going to be in trade paperback. You know what? I'm not worried about it. Why? Because this is one graphic novel, which is, I think, very relevant to these days that we are presently living in. It's uh, quite a fair sized book. And the art is very interesting too. Uh, we've also got Crimson Flower by Matt Kint. And Kyle Higgins Volume 1 of Radiant Black. Now moving into some of the other comics that I got. Um, on the right hand side, I'll get to that after I cover this side, we have Shazam, issue 2, I did ask for issue 1 to be sent out, but I think they might have forgotten that I asked for it, so I'm going to have to um, try to fix it up for the next haul. Sinister War, issue 3, I haven't even begun the first, second, or the third issue of reading this yet. Uh, Legends of the Dark Knight, this is something I need to catch up with. The latest issue of Radiant Black. And Superman Red and Blue. I'm thinking what I might maybe do is cover one of the stories in this in the next um, action comics and detective comics. Uh, review on the channel just because of there's probably one or two particular stories that I like of what I've read for, so far now something else that I'll be reviewing on the channel Nightwing issue 83 Moon Knight issue 2 and good news um, as you know before, um, I had this one turn up in the mail from my RCS. Well, good news, people. I can now review I Make the Boys Cry Issue 2 on the channel. Well, until then, let's keep it colourful. And a big thanks to all the subscribers to the channel. Um... I'm really looking forward to putting out some more content. And also, I wouldn't mind an idea or two. Um, I have put it in my about section as well. Um, I need some suggestions for when I start to reach 250 to 255 plus subscribers for the next celebration and also the 300. So, I'm very open to what you have for ideas. 
all except one. Until then, let's keep it colourful and have yourself an awesome day.